Okay, it's not freaking clickbait. Sienna is actually back on TikTok. Um, I wish I was joking, but I'm not. So if you guys want the rundown, I can do a quick rundown. Sienna May was canceled not really canceled but a lot of people called her out for doing something that she got caught doing on video which was assaulting in a bad way can't say it a, a guy uh, jack wright and um yeah it's pretty much facts that she did all this stuff jack wright came out with a huge video about it if you want to check it out go watch it it's called what cnma did to me it's still up and she got a lot of hate and so she got off the app but just recently, Sienna Mae came back to TikTok after not being on TikTok since January. And this was her last post, and this is the new series of posts. Now, I'm not going to play the post that she posted because this video will get copyright striked. But it's basically a music video. She apologized for her assault with a music video before in which she danced to a Sam Smith song and a lot of people roasted her for that. Well, she came at us with another music video to the tune of, I hope they cancel me. And in the video, she said, I dedicate this song to cancel culture. I can show you guys the video that, that is playing. But um, yeah, it says, this video is brought to you by cancel culture. I said, you shouldn't be canceled. You should be jailed. And uh, this post was definitely muted. Nobody even liked it. You can't find it unless I look at it. But it's like, it's saying, I hope they cancel me. Cancel culture, you can kiss my tail. I don't care if you cancel me. Here's me sitting on a beach um, in my bikinis talking about how fat I am again. Um, and yeah, she is still back dancing in her clothes and things and still hardly wearing clothes anyways so there you go there you go back to your regu regularly scheduled content anyway she's back she's really freaking back and this isn't good that she's back one because i hope she doesn't use her power to abuse other people but i think people are um wary of how she is now so hopefully that won't happen but two, if you look in the comments, it's all support. But don't let this fool you because, hey, she deletes comments. Now, lately, it seems like, oh, okay, at least, uh, at least she posts again, yay. But it, um, it seems like finally some people are like calling her out on it, but, oof. No one switched up. There's still people that support her no matter what. Y'all switched up, girl. We missed you. Y'all, so brave. Missed her so much, not a joke. It's, uh, it's, it's not the best situation. But hey, it be like that sometimes. Sienna, Sienna May's back, and I think the best thing we can do is to let her fade into irrelevancy. I don't want to see her come back. I don't want to see her have a platform anymore, but TikTok has a history of not doing anything to people who clearly have either violated the law or um, abused people, and that's just how TikTok is, and unfortunately, we are being forced to deal with it, and we have to deal with it again with Sienna May. Here's the facts. Sienna May absolutely did really bad things to dudes and it's not just jack wright is the scary thing i've had a lot of people dm me telling me about some very suspicious things she's done in la i don't want to say people's names because i don't want to um speak for them and tell their stories without their permission so i'm not going to do that but all i can say is she does this crap so what can we do? We cannot watch her stuff. We cannot consume her content. Hopefully that will keep her in Hawaii where she is right now, where we don't have to watch her anymore. Um, so that's really, that's really what we have to do here in this situation. She's back, but nothing's going to happen to her. She's always going to have those stands that always support her. But as long as we continue to call her out on the stuff she's done and we continue to remind her of what she's done and remind her stands of what she's done maybe she'll finally lose those stands and um i mean yeah she's back but it doesn't seem like it doesn't seem like she's just gonna be taking over the world like she was when she was absolutely blowing up on tiktok selling did you eat today merch and things like that um 
<laughs> Hopefully she's no longer the per poster girl for body positivity. Um, but hey, it's over. I'm not really, I don't really want to talk about her anymore because I don't want to give her attention. I feel like she wants that. I feel like she needs that in order to stay thriving. That's why she's making these videos on, on mock and cancel culture. When it's not about cancel culture, it's about the fact that she did something actually illegal. I don't think she should be canceled. I think she should be in jail. I think she anime should be in jail. Um, because you obviously did something that was against the law. You got caught on video doing it. But... Hey, what can you do? Um, obviously, it's not enough for TikTok to punish her. Obviously, it's not enough for her stands to stop standing her. And obviously, I'm still going to get called crazy when I'm speaking out against her, even though it should be happening. But hey, see, anime's back. Um, she came back to YouTube a little bit ago. And, uh,. Mm. Hopefully she doesn't make another Sam Smith music dancing video. But, uh... Mm, not good. Not good at all.